Hearts. Glanamede Castle. Stronghold of Lord Balsef. Self-imposed ruler of all Calaglia. I've never seen it from this close before. That's it, all right. And next to it are the Gates of Fire. Take a good long look while you still can. That wall is what we've come to tear down. The only thing standing between us and freedom. Freedom. Let's go. Be careful. If you get close to a Zoogal, they'll attack. fight any enemies you can otherwise avoid, all right? Makes sense. If we try to take them all on, they'll be... Normally, I don't pick on the uh, weak. Take this! Uh, I can't move! Fall back! Slut! I'll bring you back from death to Tell door! Circle and bring them down! Uh, take this! You're finished! How's this? Uh, had it coming! Here I go! Rising Touch cannon! Cleave right through him! You can leave that to me. Not so fast! Never I'm not over the hill just yet! Talon sword! I can feel my power growing! What a weird stone. I sense a strange power from it. We should gather as many as we can find. This is... Seems you found something good. Supplies like that are valuable. Never overlook them. Got it. I'll remember that. Let's stop a moment to catch our breath. But I've barely worked up a sweat. Speak for yourself. What do you want, a medal? Doesn't look like we're being followed. Fail to grab these rare moments of quiet when you can. You'll end up regretting it later. You're the boss. Normally, we should take turns standing guard, but this first time, I'll watch over things so you two can rest easy. I've never just sat and... A Master Corps, huh? Now I see. So that's why Balsef's cronies were so desperate to catch her. Is that what it's called? The jewel in her chest? Oh, right. You don't remember a damn thing, do you? Ah, fair enough. I guess it's time to fill you back in. 
Tell me, you ever wonder why we Danans are made to work ourselves to the bone, day in, day out? Well, when you put it like that, I always just assumed we were mining resources for them. Then don't you think it'd be quicker if they used all that high-powered tech they have? Why go to all the trouble of relying on weak human labor? Listen, what the Renans are really after isn't resources or minerals. It's astral energy. They're harvesting the astral energy that sleeps inside all matter in life forms. And they're doing it the same way they have for the past 300 years, using us Danans as mere siphons. Right. They have machines for minerals, but extracting from Danans requires spirit cores. Any astral energy collected passes through a spirit vessel on its way to being stored in a master core. But why go to the trouble of collecting all this energy in the first place? Do they really need all that juice just to use astral arts? It determines the Sovereign. Sovereign? Is that the Renan ruler? Exactly. Five lords, each doing whatever it takes to gather as much astral energy as they can and store it in their master cores. Whichever of them manages to accumulate the most power at the end of their contest is crowned the ruler of the Renan Motherland. A new crown contest, as they call it, is held every decade or so. So you see, the master cores are the receptacles in which the lords store their power. And we Danans are sacrificed, so the Renans can choose their new ruler. That's insane! You're telling me that's what our people have been dying for this whole time?! Relax, hero. You're not the only one who's bent out of shape about the whole thing. There are two things that I haven't been able to get my head around yet. What business would a Renan have stealing a Master Corps? And what's the deal with that blazing sword? I think the sword is a physical manifestation of the Master Corps' astral energy. As for why it took the shape of a sword, well, I don't know any more than you do. Honest. And that stuff about needing your permission to use it? What was that about? I'm the only one of us who can control the Master Corps to some extent. Without me to adjust the flow of astral energy, the sword can't take a physical form. What do you want out of this? You may be one of them, but you don't strike me as the ruthless oppressor type. I'm going to take down all of the lords. Never thought I'd say this, but I like the cut of your jib, Renan. <laughs> Very well. As far as we're concerned, the struggle continues either way. And with that sword on our side, our chances of victory just increased. That is, of course, assuming we can count the two of you in. Fine by me. After all, it sounds like we're after the same thing anyway. I... <laughs> Honestly, I'm still a little confused by all this. But if it's a choice between this or going back to being a slave, then I choose to fight. Then it's settled. Together we'll overthrow the Renan Lords. And first up on that chopping block is Balsef, the wild beast. Sound good? We have another secret hideout in Ulzebek, not far from here. We should be able to meet up with our comrades there.
I hate camping out. Can you even see out of that thing? Like, at all? Of course I can. How else do you think I manage to avoid tripping everywhere I go? What is that thing anyway? It doesn't look like anything Dan and I've ever seen. Beats me. I don't remember anything about my past. When I came to, I was already wearing it. If I could get it off, I would. Damn thing makes it hard to eat. And I can't scratch my face when it itches. It's the worst. Honestly, I'm just impressed you've managed to survive this long looking like that. I'm sure you attract attention wherever you go. Most of the other Danans don't pay it any mind. It's in everyone's best interest to just keep their heads down, focus on their work, and pretend they don't notice. What about the Renan soldiers? Didn't they notice? The guards? They're more the kill first, ask questions later type. Be in the wrong place or step out of line and you're dead. Mask or no mask. That said, as long as you keep your head down and don't cause trouble, they mostly ignore you. Honestly, sometimes they don't look all that keen to stir up trouble themselves. A friend of mine said it's because if they kill us without a good reason, it could delay the work and put them behind schedule. At that point, it'd be their necks on the line. You should know more about all that than me, though, right? I don't serve any of the lords. But I see what you mean. After three centuries of run and rule without much upheaval, it's possible the soldiers might be losing their edge. All this trouble we've caused might be the first excitement they've had in a while. Well, I don't plan on getting killed for their amusement. We should be able to eat this. Whenever you find some, make sure to grab it. It's edible, huh? Good to know. Definitely. <sighs> What's this thing? We've almost made it to Ulzebek. That's not your run-of-the-mill enemy. This one's tough, but we have no choice. There. Let me no. know if you need healing. Can't Put them here. Down. Fall back. I'll bring Talent you back store. from death's abyss. Dig deep, brothers. I'll bring you back from death's abyss. Resuscitation. Not done yet. Got you. Mega ray. Swallow blade. Rising wyvern. There. One more. Mega Over. Ray. I'll bring you back from Death's Abyss! Huh. I'll bring you back from Death's Abyss! Resuscitate! This can't be happening! I'm not done yet!
Normally, I don't pick on the weak. Right. Right. I'll run you through. Had it coming. Head talent. I'm only getting started. Don't go this. We gotta roll Slut. with it. Swallow Had blade. Talent right. store. Slut. Swallow I'm blade. I'm on it. <laughs> See ya. I'm sure I can put this to use. Hoo-hoo! Hoo-hoo! That's an unusual bird. It's an owl. They're often used as a symbol to represent ancient Dana. I'll take you all on! Rising Wyvern! It's You're off! How's this? You're surrounded! Just stay calm! Slut! Swallow blade! Slut! Slut! Cannon. Slut. Here I go! Swallow blade! You're mine! You're finished! How's this? That is coming! Here I come! Let's Talon Storm! You're finished! It's over! Stop! Rising Wyvern! Here, let me help! How's this? Smooth escape! That is coming! They're targeting Shion! Here I come! It's over! Who wants to die next? Swallow How's Blade! this? You're See mine! Ya. You're finished! Talon Storm! Well, take a look at that! What's this thing? Okay, people, this is it. Ools are back. No sign of any Renin guardsmen. The Renins aren't as populous as the Danans. Probably figure stationing guards in a place like this would be a waste of precious manpower. So this is where the next safe house is? Yes. The last place they'd think to look for enemies is on their own doorstep. That is, assuming anyone actually made it here before us. Zephyr! Looks like we needn't have worried. Come on.
Looks like we get to sleep with a roof over our heads. Zephyr, you made it! See? I told you there's no way Zephyr would have kicked the bucket. Fine, you were right. So, what's the plan? Well, we've got an ace up our sleeve and the enemy's in disarray. I say we strike while the iron's hot. So we're finally going head to head with Balsef. That's right. We can't afford to mess this up. It's now or never. Then now it is! We've all been waiting for this day for far too long! Leave the plan to me. In the meantime... Yeah, you two need to do something about your outfits. I have just the thing for your size. Stay right there, okay? I told you, it fits like a dream. I'm afraid we don't have any Renan clothing. I could find you some Danon outfits. But something tells me you'd rather pass. Is this really that important? In case you need reminding, I'm here because our interests overlapped. Nothing more. At no point did I say I've given up being a Renan. Now, now, let's play nice. How about you ask Nate and see what he says? He's our one-stop shop for info around here. With any luck, he might just know something. <laughs> 